In this tutorial, we will learn layer concept. In this drawing, layers are applied. Because of layers, you can apply the colors to the object and you can use the different line types. In order to use layers, you will have to at first create the layers. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create them and use them. Keyboard shortcut for layer is LA, enter. It will display layer properties manager. And you can also give layer command from here. Click on this layer properties. It will bring the same layer properties manager. By default AutoCAD work on zero layer. If you want to create your own layer, click here on new layer. Then give the name to the layer. The name should be meaningful one. You can apply different logic for the names. You can give as per the line type, as per the view, top view, front view. If you are from civil line, you can give it wall, door, window, like that. Suppose I will give as per the line type, I will say outline. After that, from here, change the color for that layer. Then give the line type. Right now, for outline, I want to use the continuous. Therefore, I will not change it. From here, you can choose the thickness. Okay. Then, if you need a transparency to the layer, from here, you can change the transparency and if you don't want to print a particular layer you can click on this the red symbol shows that this layer will not be printed and if you want to print it don't click there and keep it as it is then it will print properly again click on new layer suppose i want to create a layer for center line i'll give it name center choose the color then here I want to change the line type to center. Click on this continuous. Now center is not there. Click on load. Click inside for center. Give the first character C. Here is the center. Then click on OK. Then select the center. Click on OK. Then again new layer. I want it to be for dotted line. Dot dot. Then choose the color. You can choose color from this true color also. If you want any color, or you can make it dark or faint. Or here, ready-made color blocks are also given there. From there also, you can choose the particular color. And click on OK. Then line type. Here I want hidden line. Click on the center. Load. Click here. For hidden, first character is H. Select the hidden line. OK. Click on hidden. OK. I don't want any line weight, click here and make it default. Okay. Same way I don't want it line weight for this center. Select it and make it default. Then close this layer properties manager. Then from here select the layer on which you want to perform your work. I want to create center line, select this center layer. Click on the name, don't click on the color. If you click on the color, you will be able to change the color click on the name of the layer then that layer will become current and if you create any object on it it will be with that color and in that line type I will create one circle also now I want to create dotted lines make the dot dot current then create the object then I actually want some faint color here so I will choose some other color to array it, give the array command. Then to increase the gap between center line or hidden line, you will have to give the LTS command. Line type scale. Shortcut is LTS. Enter. Then increase the scale factor. If you increase the scale factor, the gap between center line and hidden line will increase. And if you reduce the scale factor, again give the LTS. Enter. Reduce the scale factor, the gap between the center line and hidden line will reduce. Then make the outline current. Then create some object on the outline. Then if you want to change the layer of some object. Suppose I want this object to be of center line type layer. Then there is one method is match properties. Click on match properties. Then select the source object. Select the center line. Select the destination object. I want this object to be center. Click on it. So it will become center. Press escape or enter to come out. This is the one method. If I want to change the layer of this circle to outline. Other method is select the object. And from here select the name of the 
layer on which you want to transfer those selected object press escape there are some other facilities are also available for layer you can make the layer on off if suppose i make this dot dot layer off so object on it will be invisible and if you want to bring them back again click here and click on this bulb symbol it will come back and then next is freeze if you freeze the object the object will be invisible plus the benefit is that if you have a bigger drawing when you zoom pan the object it takes time you can make it faster by freezing the layers and if you bring back the object click on it so it will again will be displayed properly that means using on off you can only make the layer on off but it will be considered for zoom and pan and if you freeze them then it will not be considered for zoom and pan therefore your zoom and pan will operate fast then next is you can lock or unlock layer if you lock the layer then on those object modify command will not work suppose if i select erase and select all the object and press enter the lock layer object are not deleted from here again you can unlock them so it will become normal operational object suppose one, we will create one more layer called hatch and we want it to be continuous line type and we want to give some transparency to it suppose i want to make it 50% transparent okay close it i will create one gradient hatch then close that creation click on modify and make it bring to front select the object enter then i want to show the below object using the transparency select this hatch click on the home and change the layer to this hatch then press escape now as we have given the transparency to the layer this hatch has become transparent and if you remove this transparency and make it zero okay and close this so below object are not visible and again if we increase the transparency if you make it 60% okay and close it the object below the hatch is visible and if we try to make some layer non plottable suppose we will make this dot dot layer non plottable and if we try to print the object and give the area and watch the preview so here you will view that the circles are not shown because we have made it non plottable and if you want to make it plottable again here from here we will remove this and if we now try to print it now the circles are visible in this way you can use the option of plotting the layers whether you want to plot the layers or not